what happened in Acts chapter 2 was more than an individual filling of the Holy Spirit. It was a corporate filling of the Holy Spirit when people didn't just come and just were in a building. They were in one accord. They were in one spirit, one harmony, as the Bible says, one mind, one vision, one purpose. They came into a sense of one accord. And what happened when they came into a sense of one accord? The Holy Spirit came upon them all. There was a sense of the presence of God. There was a power of God that came. And what came out of it? That came the church of Jesus Christ as the power of God came upon Peter and they stood together and preached the gospel and 3,000 people came to Christ in that first day. And then you find just a few days later, Acts chapter 5, 5,000 people and the church is growing day by day by day. Was it because they were singing the right songs? Was it because they were having prayer lines and stuff like this? No, it was because they were so together that they didn't even need a prayer line to be filled with the Holy Spirit. God just came and filled them with the Holy Spirit. I don't want to tell you this morning what God wants to do in our church and what God wants to do in the churches of Red the churches of our nation is he doesn't want just to lay on hands and a nice filling of the Holy Spirit for an individual. He wants to see a Spirit-filled church. A church that's so full of the Spirit, so full of the power of God that you come to church on Sunday morning, one vision, one heart, one direction, filled with the Spirit out with power to see what God wants to do. 